What is this? Whoa. Oh my gosh, guys, we could be in for it. That says 14K. Oh no. Sketchy. Look like a nice guy though. This one's silver. I hate to say it, but you're missing a pretty good sunset back behind me. But I gotta tell you a couple things first about this episode. Number one, we just hit over 700 subscribers. That's amazing. I can't believe how many people actually enjoy the content and it makes me feel good. So thank you for making me feel good. Number two, business and YouTube and things have been picking up pretty crazy. And I feel like it's been just a wild ride in general thank you for for having some patience with me in this episode we find some pretty cool stuff in a storage unit and just for old time's sake we're gonna roll the original intro to the channel thank you guys for watching seriously it means the world to me In this episode, we got a storage unit that we got $500 into. We got an empty trailer here. Let's go check it out. Okay, so first off, from the pictures, I looked up this helmet right here. Saw that used, they're selling for around 50 bucks. I was like, all right, cool. Uh, opened it up, looks like it's pretty much new. I don't think it's ever been used. It's still got stuff in the packaging, so that's good. This is gonna be a $70 bill right off the bat. I saw the washer and dryer, and or I saw the washer or dryer. I can't tell which one it is at the moment. I'm hoping there's another one in there. If I, if I can get that set, that's pretty much a lot of money back right off the bat. Um, Right here, I saw that this poster says Nintendo. Nintendo posters, so that means that they were at least some some gamers, maybe some video games in there. I couldn't see this uh, uh, TV from the pictures, but it's up there, and that looks like a pretty good one, 42 inches. Not a great brand, but first off, the first thing that rolled out as I opened this thing up is all this nastiness. But, uh, you know, what can you do? State laws are state laws. I'm going to start ripping some stuff out and see what's in there. Hey, check out that box. That looks interesting. Oh, more, more weed stuff. Okay. Make a pile here, I guess. I did see that this mattress was here when I opened the door. I couldn't see that in the pictures. And it doesn't look very clean. Uh, let's see what's in this toolbox, huh? Ooh, it's heavy. All right. So, it looks like it's got some decent DeWalt stuff in here. A new blade. The biggest pair of scissors I've ever seen. Probably gotta look those up. That might be worth something. Yeah, so these were probably for working, but usually when I find these, I think pew, pew, pew. Oh, this is why it's so heavy. Two and a half pounds of weight right there. Okay, guys, I ain't mad at that. Let's see what's in here, some strap. Yeah, I like straps. I like those. Those are new, that's cool. Always handy. Look at these long suckers. A whole set of these in the bottom of there. Okay, let's see what else is in here. We busted open a few of these clothing bins right here. That one's full of shoes. This one's got shirts and stuff in it. Nothing special in here, guys, but I do like it whenever I see all the clothes is folded. You know, we got Jordans and Nikes and Adidas stuff. This is some Nike sweatshirts. Uh, and that one's Adidas, so uh, decent, decent little lot, you know, not much, but I ain't mad at it, right? And uh, if I'm gonna have to get clothes, might as well be nice and folded up. 
So I busted this one up. I saw these Heelys right off the bat. And these can do pretty good, guys. I mean, look them up, surprisingly. Not bad. Looks like we got something in there. Some Heely stuff. Let's see what kind of shoes they got. Um, what is this? Whoa. Feels like it's in there too, guys. Oh, sorry. I get excited and I drop stuff. Did you guys see the the last videos? I kept dropping stuff. Oh, wow. There's another one. Let's see what's in them. Dang, guys. Right off the bat. Let's go. All right. These look like Harleys. Some Harley. Whenever uh, I see nice Harley boots, I like these ones that they call harness boots. They got the straps across here. For whatever reason, they seem to sell for a little bit more. Uh, harness boots. Yep. There's the other one. These are just kind of off brands. I can tell just by feeling them. Um, and some old old shoes there. So the rest of them are definitely flea market. But um, the Heelys and the Harleys will probably go on eBay. Let's see what's in these boxes. Uh, that one's in there. It's definitely a newer version of it. And this one's going to be a newer version of it as well. So nothing crazy on these but definitely cool let's see if they have any games okay guys this is what i was hoping for i hope so anyways i was about to pick up this thing right here these little ac units do really good at the flea market that's quick money right there but look at what's on top of it oh man i hope it's a nice jewelry box and i hope there's some good stuff in here send me jewelry Send me gold. Nalgene in there. Nothing crazy. Hope I find the lid to that because that'll help it sell quick. Um, okay. Well, it is a jewelry box, but it doesn't look like they kept very good condition of it. Uh, it is taped closed, which is nice. I know that the facility hasn't been into it at least. That means I can buy here again. Yay! Okay guys, GoPro died, but I'm back at it. No worries. I'm gonna get this unveiling for y'all. I'm gonna get it. You guys are gonna know. <clears throat> okay, right off the bat, um, Mr. Dab stuff, and with all the weed stuff we've already found, there's gonna be some paraphernalia in here. I was expecting weed, man. Okay, I don't think I see anything that's like standing out at me as silver or gold. But. Oh, I poked my finger. This one looks like it's got some markings on it. So, oh my gosh, guys, we could be in for it. Okay. So that little piece right there is marked, and I believe it's gold and matches. So one little bitty piece looks like. says 925 925 I'll definitely look at this closer at the house my wife likes to look through it uh, 
and that one looks like it's looks like that one's 925 as well what's in the drawers what's in them drawers I see gold. It's got a marking of FD on one side. It was pretty. Uh oh. This right here, guys, says 14K. That says 14K. Oh no. That's 14 carats. Whoo! Guys, that is pretty. That is pretty and it's real. Oh my gosh. That's a pretty piece. Wow. Okay guys, gold ring in there. I am happy about that. Oh my goodness, yes. It is a good one too, guys. It is a good one. It was in this, it was in all this junk. That is a pretty ring. That is a really pretty ring. This is silver. Uh, it's plated though. Because it does not look real. So that makes me suspicious of the ring. But man, it does look real. It looks older too, as I was looking at it. Let me look at that again. Yeah, 14. It's real. This is real. There's no. Yeah, it's real. That's real. Mm. Love it. Love it. What's in this one? Let's have another one in there. You got another one of those in here? Really matches. Uh, decent looking costume stuff though. believe that nice ring was in here okay here we go last one the best is in the bottom gross hair very sentimental to them what's in here these look like silver they're cufflinks I'll get those out in a second and tell you if they're silver though this one's silver seems like I'm seeing matches too to everything so at least there's at least there's matches to the earrings and things like that I don't know if you guys are gonna really get a good angle to all this, but this one says 925 Sun. 925 Sun. Mom. That's pretty. Silver. This one might be silver. 
not sure. This one's silver. 925. And then it says 10K on it. So 925 and 10K. So that means some of this might be gold. Uh, I don't know about that. But definitely silver scrap anyways. Regardless of the 10K plating or whatever was going on there. Let's see. Try to make this entertaining real quick. I'm going to zip through it. If I find anything else um, as we're going through it tonight, I'll definitely throw that in at the end of the video. So let's keep cruising here. We did find some gold pieces, guys. We did find some gold pieces. I feel like we need to take the drawers out and look in the bottom of this thing. I'm going to do that off camera.